It's Dario from Wise Analytics. In this video, we are going to talk about how to interpret and use an association analysis report. The association analysis is also called market basket analysis. And the aim of the association analysis is to identify those items that are most commonly purchased together. Like if you buy beer, you tend to buy chips too. Now, let's start from the top of the report. At the top we've got support and lift, or actually average support and average lift. Now, what is the support and what is the lift? The support is the frequency of that particular association across the transactions. So how often a particular association happens across all your transactions. On the other hand, the lift is a little bit more complicated to understand. Let's imagine that you're flipping a coin. If you flip a coin, you've got 50-50 chances that you can get tail or head. But if you scrape one of the two sides of the coin, what happens is that the probability is not anymore 50-50, maybe it's 30-70. So if you divide 50 by 50, what you get is 1. 1 represents the random probability. On the other hand, if you divide 70 by 30, you get something more than 1. So what does it mean? that you have a lift that is more than one. It means that the association is not happening just by chance. It's not happening randomly. It's happening because there's a particular behavior, there's a particular preference of your customers for that particular association. Like uh, sodas and sandwiches, for instance, or beers and chips. Now let's move on and let's talk about this table below here. This table contains the top 25 associations by lift. What does it mean? It means that this association here at the top is the association with the highest lift. And as you can see, you can also see that there's a left hand side here and a right hand side. The left hand side is basically the driver of your association. The right hand side is kind of the dependent variable of the association. So for instance, if your customer goes to the shop to buy a beer, he will also buy maybe chips for instance. The left hand side will be the beer and the right hand side will be the chips. If you're wondering what is the best association for beer, the answer would be chips in this case. So, the left hand side corresponds to the independent variable and the right hand side corresponds to the dependent variable. Thank you for watching. For any other clarification, please contact me at dario at Thank you.